how intense was it for you to do this? Because sitting in the movie theater, uh, it just starts and then the movie ends. It feels like it lasts three minutes. It's that intense. Yeah, well, it was. Uh, it took a long time to shoot. Obviously, technically, it was very complicated. We built uh, one of the largest sets ever constructed for a film. Uh, we built an actual oil rig in a parking lot in New Orleans at the old Six Flags. And, uh, you know, we tried to recreate uh, as much of it as we possibly could. Um, you know, did all the stunts. And, you know, it was one of those things where, you know, we had a huge responsibility to get it right. We really wanted to honor the 11 people who died after uh, the deep water exploded. There was a lot of news coverage, but most of it was about the environmental disaster and not much uh, mention was made of the 11 people. Uh, so we wanted to honor them and all the other survivors of the deep water. Right. Uh, and, and in terms of uh, meeting Mike... Williams and making sure that you were true to him. What is that like for you in your profession to meet somebody that you know you're going to play on the screen? Well, I just thought it was really important. It was crucial that we had Mike be a part of it. You know, nobody knew the, the rig better than Mike, and he was the last one off the rig. Uh, so I was able to reach out to him, had a conversation, and I convinced everybody that we needed to have him on as a, as a consultant. And so he was there the entire time. Uh, he was the one who made sure that everything was authentic and realistic and accurate. And, you know, he was kind of like my guide. Uh, my eyes, my ears, you know, he took me to rig school. And uh, I was honored to, uh, to be able to make the movie and to tell his story and play him. Mark Wahlberg joining me here on The Rich Eisen Show uh, on, again, uh, uh, two days after it premiered in New Orleans. What was that like to premiere this film in that town? Uh, well, we, wanted, we made sure we had to shoot the movie there, and we wanted to show the movie there first. And we wanted to show it to the families uh, of the 11 people and to the survivors. And, you know, they were obviously very reluctant to allow us to make the movie or be involved in the process because of the lack of uh, concern when, or, you know, black media coverage and respect for the fact that their loved ones had perished on the rig. So when we told them we were able to communicate what our intentions were, and then they, they had seen a lone survivor. And then they came on board because they knew Pete and I uh, wanted to honor them. And they were just grateful. You know, it was, it was way overdue, uh, you know, and, you know, they needed to be honored. And their memory needed to be honored. And, uh, you know, there was a lot, of, a lot of tears, very emotional, but uh, very happy. And, uh, so, and, and there's some great people that are in this film, too, Mark. Uh, John Malkovich is in this film. Kate Hudson and, and Kurt Russell. We were okay. waiting to see if there would ever be a scene with them. I think there was just one scene at the end where they might have been in the same scene, but maybe not in the same shot. I mean, that's an interesting situation to have a father-daughter situation going on in this film. Mark, right? Yeah. Yeah. They had never, uh, they had never worked together on a movie before. Um, so they were, uh, in, you know, there's only that one moment uh, at the at the, uh, the hotel yeah. uh, when, when, when Kurt's coming in and we're leaving. But, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it was nice having them both in the movie. They, we have an amazing cast. You know, Malcolm is fantastic. Gina Rodriguez did a great job. That's right. Michael Bryan. Um, you know, but the great thing is with a movie like this, everybody gets involved, and it's not about their own individual experience. They're all going and paying tribute uh, to these people. And uh, it just becomes a much more gratifying uh, experience. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.